All right, very quickly before we get into today's battle, uh, I wanted to go over what UPA Adapt was. This is, uh, I'm going to say our league, and I mean that very loosely because I don't really do much here, but it's uh, JB's league and Orion's league. Mid helps out a lot too. I'm kind of just there. I'm a, I guess I'm an admin, dude. I've been known to fucking, you know, I'll, I'll mute a chat or somebody every now and then or something, you know, but... Um, this is a BDSP little uh, Wi-Fi tournament thingy that uh, JB and Dorian wanted to do. I, of course, was like, yo, <laughs> battles with the boys, I'm in, you know? So, we gotta deal with the 20-minute timer, so we don't really want people to just stall everyone out, because then every game is gonna go to timer, it's gonna be annoying, I'm gonna hate it here, first of all. So, kind of in the same idea of our uh, PCT, the Button Click League, this is kind of gonna be a similar thing. It kind of says, like, you know, right here, do the 20-minute timer. Please don't bring stall if you, you know, try not to be a piece of shit, basically, is what it's saying here. So, um, every week, there's, other than week one, there's going to be, like, a uh, a little a little fun thing thrown into the, uh, thrown into the, the building part. So, like, sometimes a tier will be banned, sometimes an item might not be usable, sometimes, you know, maybe no choice items or whatever. There'll be, like, a stipulation to your build every week. But basically, you have 60 points, and you get to go to these tiers, and you just build a team, right? And it's not full draft, so you can, you, you don't, like, you could, technically, you could bring the same team as somebody else, and you would play a full-on 6v6 mirror match. But, uh, with a little creativity, hopefully that doesn't happen, although it would be hilarious. But, like, for my first team... I'm taking Chomp, Memo, Xplowd, Oopsie, Cradilly, and Luxray. You gotta have one from each tier, and then you only, like I said, you only have uh, 60 points. So you gotta be mindful. You gotta be mindful of your puntos here. So now that I've used these six mons for week one, I can't use any of those six for week two. So for week two, you gotta bring other things, and then for week three, you can't bring anything you brought week two. You know, and then plus there'll be some stipulations thrown in there, be some item bans, maybe some fun wacky shit to kind of make you. Uh, what does it say on the thing here? Fun stuff like that to force you to dot, 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 adapt. You know, we, yeah, that's the whole thing, you know? So, um, I brought, I, I was looking at, I was, when I was doing the team building, right, I think that fully explains it. Like that, you, you guys get it now, 6v6, BDSP Wi-Fi, got a bunch of homies in here, and we're going to just be playing some fun, some fun battles here and bringing some wacky shit, right? So, um... If you look at the S tier, Garchomp, Gliscor, Latios, Latias, and Manaphy, I think everyone is going to be taking one of those five. So I, I just kind of assumed on every team I would be fighting, there's going to be one of those five every time. And Manaphy, in my opinion, is kind of the weakest of the of the ones. So I wanted an Ice Shard Mon for sure, right? So I literally built this team around uh, Garchomp and Mamoswine, and then just kind of threw everything else in there. Once Garchomp and Mamoswine were involved, I was like, that's a lot of physical offense. Let's throw a Specs x Cloud in this bitch. We'll have kind of a uh, like a lead pivot Uxie. We'll have a Luxray for uh, helping break down these bulky waters. And we'll have a Cradilly because my team hates switching into Sculpt, you know? So that is kind of going to be just a general little rundown of uh, how this is going to work. I hope you guys are going to enjoy. It should be real fun. And uh, real quickly, we can go over the roster we got here. We got a got a bunch of homies in here, dude. Um, let me find it here. Um, it's me, Dorian, Trexo, Goki, JB, uh, Talon, Gertz in here. That's a cool guy. I like him. Uh, Jack, CB, Q, Lucas, Razor. Actually, Razor just dropped. And then we have some uh, some new faces in here. Some people that I think were either in uh, UPA Showdown last season or just that replied to the uh, to the app. So like uh, Arcaniner, which that is so misspelled that hurt my brain. Arcaniner, Bread Pudding, uh, TD Zero, fucking Quincy Adams, Bandu, A Prater, Bruno, Joe to Flamin. You know, we got a bunch of people in here, a bunch of really, re like a real strong coach pool is in this thing, dude. Like nobody, I'm out here trying to play fun games and I got to go up against Jack, dude. I got to go up against Jack and CB. Are you kidding me? I kind of hate it here, but it's going to be fun. I'm really excited to show you guys the battle we have today. So uh, without further ado, let's get into it. I'm going to shut the fuck up. All right, here we are at the battle. You can see what he brought. You can see what I brought. I'll leave it up for a little while. Uh, this is UPA Adapt versus Bruno7. You know, so we got some things, we got some stuff. I've been pinged. Yeah, <laughs> that one's just for you, buddy. Yeah, that, that one's just for you. <laughs> um, yeah, breaking Umbreon looks 
real fucking annoying, but uh, we'll do we'll do our best, you know. I didn't import my team, unfortunate. He leads Haunter. I don't like that at all. <laughs> um, I should live any hit from this, right? I should live any hit from this, but I don't know if I... Like, I don't need to take that damage, though. So let's just go into our... Uh, let's go into our boy here. Pretty obvious play, but we're going to make it. Also, need to just click buttons. I don't really give a fuck. He does just click Shadow Ball. I imagine this is going to be Scarf. And he doesn't exactly have a switch into this. If he does, like, Destiny Bond me, that's a good play on his part. Okay, so I'm assuming that's just going to be Scarf Honor. Umbreon comes out. Let me see a 2-hit KO. Let me see a thick 2-hit KO, dude. <laughs> You'd love to see it. I don't need HP bar. Um, if he has like protect and stuff, he can do it, and that's gonna be very annoying. But uh, you know, fuck it. Hey, remember the guy and the stuff, the the things I said? Yeah, that's the one. Okay, fuck. Um, we could just take him to high roll temple right now. We could just try to get the. Uh, the high roll. I don't really have much else in ways of breaking this, so I'm gonna keep clicking it, dude. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna keep clicking it. Clickety, clickety, click, click. Lives again. Goes for Wish. Goes for Wish. And that has been 14 minutes of our timer already. Golly gee willikers. So now he has to protect again. I'm gonna just go into... Ray Romano. If he throws off a foul play and catches me, that's a good play on his part. But, uh... Umbreon is, like, our strongest guy. I mean, this is, like, our strongest guy. So, potentially, we can go for a Icicle Crash into an Earthquake and uh, pick this guy off. Ooh, or I can throw off a Stone Edge, expecting the Rotom Heat. Because either way... We don't kill in one hit, so let's throw off a Stone Edge first. Let's throw off a Stone Edge first, dude. Show me. Okay, good damage. Good damage. Great damage. Do we think... He has speed for us. I don't think he has speed for us. I'm gonna click it again, dude. I don't give a fuck. Bonk! Gone. Rotom Heat. Gone. Love to see it. Mammal Swine's taking two hits of Life Orb. Uh, this gives him Starmie. This does give him Starmie. I need to preserve this. This is one of our best ways of dealing with the Carnivine that I guess kind of puts in a little bit of work against us. Uh, so he's got Starmie. I have just the thing an ice beam could potentially hurt but I'm not too upset about it I can also get up rocks he does ice beam good play analytic is probably gonna hurt a lot that hurt a lot it did in fact hurt okay so he is oh oh, oh, oh he's the thing in the stuff dude oh he's so the thing in the stuff <laughs> Um, I will just try to get up my Stealth Rocks. I assume he just kills me with Ice Beam. Yeah. So Create Dilly is going to die. No problem, though. Um, so we can go into... Ooh, we don't actually have a lot that outspeed this. We gotta go back into X-Cloud. We gotta go back into X-Cloud. Uh, we can... We should be able to take a Hydro Pump. We're bulky as hell. We should be able to take a Hydro Pump. And without the analytic boost, oh, he does just psychic. Okay, that does a, that does chunks, dude. That does multiple chunks. But boom burst does take out the Starmie. Cool. 
Uh, so we can go into Chomp here and just kill us if he wants. He could go Umbreon and waste another uh, 19 minutes if he wants. He can. <laughs> he's got a couple plays he can do. He does go Chomp. Makes sense. Uh, I don't want to let this thing set up. Actually, it doesn't really matter if it sets up, huh? Because I have Ice Shard. So we're going to go out into Brain. We're going to go just Hard Brain. We'll just go Hard Brain, dude. He does Dragon Claw. Which doesn't do it, KO us. Nice. Does not do it, KO us. So we can go for the... We can go for the Yawn here. He does get up his Stealth Rocks. It's a little bit annoying, but not the worst. I think he assumed we would do the same thing. We'll yawn to force him out, and then I'll go for the U-turn on what I'm assuming is going to be the Umbreon. Does withdraw. Uh, I could, I guess Haunter would also make sense here. Does go Umbreon. U-turn. Doesn't look like he's in range of Boom Burst, which is unfortunate. Is unfortunate. Do we need to go Mammo? Well, you know what? Fuck it. Let's get some, uh, let's get some Luxray game time, dude. I don't think I've ever got to use a Luxray before in, like, a... Well, I think I used it in, like, one Wi-Fi battle, but you never really get to see it, you know? Don't worry, Luxray, we're gonna get burned. Versus Umbreon. Uh, Wild Charge does a fuckload, dude. And, um... I do want a quick Ice Fang. I do want a quick Ice Fang, because this thing does get superpower. He does go Carnivine. Nice. Okay. Damage. <laughs> Carnivine is such not even a real Pokemon, it's I don't even think it's in the calc. This man's got protect on everything. I think he really missed the whole there's only 20 minutes aspect of this, you know? But it's looking like that's like Fizz Def. It looks like that's just straight up Fizz Def. It looks like that is in fact just straight up Fizz Def. I'm gonna click Ice Fang again. I want my damage. Get fucked, nerd. Um, Carnivine goes down. We've both lost our ungrass types, you know. Um, and now he can probably go into Chomp if he wants. Now he can probably go Chomp. He does, in fact, go Chomp. I'm gonna click my, uh, Quick Attack, get off some chip. A little bit, just a little bit of chip, dude. Just, uh, a little bit. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. <laughs> He's SD in. I Is he Yachi? You don't SD there if you're not Yachi. I'm gonna quick attack again and hopefully that puts him in range of Mimus Wines I tried. Mammoth Swan's Ice Shard should still do over half. So we have to go into that. We're adamant Life Orb. Ooh, dude, that's tough. This might not kill. There's Yachi. I should have just Ice Fang, dude. I should have known. Oh, he fucking barely lives. That sucks. Uh, that really sucks. Mammo goes down. 
We have our own Garchomp, which could outspeed. I mean, it'd be a speed tie, you know? Um, I think we have to risk it. I think we gotta, I think we gotta go get this biscuit real quick, dude. Um, Ooxie actually should live. Ooxie should live. Ooxie should live. He'd be alright. Ooxie should live, right? And then we click... Not Yawn. We just click Psychic. Yeah. He does withdraw. He goes Umbreon again. Okay. Um, we're going to see more Wishes and Protects and all the fun stuff that we have time for in this game. So, um, I'm going to... I just want to put this thing to I want to I want to yawn this guy. Yawn into U-turn should be okay. He does have call play. Bonk. Uh yawn into memento I think is the play. It's officially late game so we got to go for game of chomp. And we will memento. I assume he's going to want to switch here. Into the Haunter. We do hard meme, which means oopsie goes down. Explod is at an amount of health that maybe it would live one, but uh, probably won't. We got Chomper. We've got autism. <laughs> you know? So what's it? he does have Umbreon. I'm gonna need an, I'm gonna need a swords dance to break the Umbreon for sure. Uh, I'm just gonna click it. Shadow Ball should only do half. He goes into his own guard chomp. Okay. Uh, it's going to come down to the speed tie. It's going to come down to the speed tie. Right here. Right here, dude. Chomp, you got it, buddy. Fuck you! Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, dude. This might... <laughs> yeah, buddy, we got the Salak. <laughs> Chomp died. We barely fucking lived. If I would have SD'd there, I would have been maximum adult, dude. But uh, Umbreon's gonna come in. No, it's not. We just Dragon Claw. So he is at about 75%. He's potentially out of range from this. It's kind of a 50-50. He doesn't know... This is if he's max fizz def too. I think I just gotta click it, dude. I think I just gotta click it. He does protect. Unfortunate. If I would've big dicked on the table there, that would've guaranteed us the win. But uh, we just gotta hope that he's not fizz def, I think. We just gotta hope he's not fizz def. We gotta pray. Just die. Just fucking die, dude. Gone. Fucking gone. Crit doesn't matter. I'm calling it right now. Doesn't matter. Probably matter. But get fucked. He won the speed tie anyways. So. <laughs> um, we get the 1-0 dub, dude. Nice. Uh, Garchomp with the Silic Berry. Silic Berry really put in work. Um. In a meta with this many priority users, I didn't think that was going to come in quite as clutch as it did, but uh, I'll gladly take my dub there, dude. We lost the speed tie, so it only makes sense that we would get the crit, because that's the same odds, right, guys? Like, subscribe, do all that bullshit. If I didn't tell you, I'm the sunglasses guy now, so don't fucking, don't, you know, come around sniffing for answers, you know? Um, yeah, bye forever.